Hey everyone, welcome to Fast Performance TV. I'm Claudio Encina. Well, we're into the fourth quarter of 2014. Can you believe it? We're in the home straight heading towards Christmas. One of the things that I know is the fourth quarter is the most critical quarter out of the whole year because it all comes down to everything that you've worked for is gonna come down to these couple of last months. And one of the things that I get from a lot of my clients asking around this time of the year is, what can I do to crush the next couple of months? You see, there's gonna be a lot of things happening. Christmas parties, Melbourne Cup, all these little distractions are gonna be coming in. And the question you have gotta ask yourself is, what are you planning to have that's gonna be meaningful in your business between now and Christmas? It's a simple question, but you have gotta start thinking and writing a couple of answers down so you can finish strong and crush it. You see, the final quarter, people tend to sometimes just sort of cruise by and finish the year off. And there's a couple of feelings that you're gonna feel on December 25, when you're sitting around with your loved ones, your friends, and it's Christmas day, you're gonna be thinking really good about your business, or you're gonna be feeling really guilty. So one of the things that I suggest that you do here right now is think about writing down a plan. Like how many listings, how many sales do you wanna make between now and Christmas? What marketing ideas do you wanna get out to the database? And your, for example, your farm area, or patch, or BDA as they also call it, what do you want to do that's going to be meaningful and have you finish really strong and powerful? So here's a couple of tips that I want to share with you today that I think will help you finish strong. Number one is clarity. Now, clarity I mean like, yeah, let's get really clear on our goals and whatever else. But I'm talking about clarity is having been in the state of consciousness. You see, being in that state of consciousness is you're there, you're present, you're in the now and you're writing it down. Not just saying, oh, I hope to get three or four sales by the end of the year and uh, hopefully that will make my really good Christmas. Well, eh, eh, ain't gonna work. Be in that state of consciousness, write it down of what you wanna be really clear on the outcomes you would like to achieve. The second tip I'd also give you is focus. Now, being totally focused between now and the end of the year is gonna be really, really challenging. Why? There's gonna be Christmas parties, as I mentioned before, and there'll be Melbourne Cups, and you know, you'll be invited, and, and you'll be going, oh, things are quieting down, so maybe I should just sort of quiet down myself, and you'll start to talk yourself into it. Here's the thing, my friends. The agents who I've seen really crush the final months have been the agents who have been focused. And when I talk about focus, I'm really talking about you being there and eliminating all distractions. It was really funny. I was overseas just a couple of months ago with my family, and I had a few friends of mine just say to me, hey Claudia, we sort of you know, messaged you on Facebook and you didn't return our message. You know why? Because at that time, I was really focused in the moment being with my family. I didn't want any distractions. You know, it's easy to sort of unplug every day from the day-to-day -day of emails and so forth. I wanted to be present. And that's why I had a really good holiday and enjoyed that time that I was with my family and of course my coach. The other thing that you wanna think about is execution between now and Christmas. How are you gonna execute? Are you gonna show up every day with a level of commitment? Because that's what executes about, commitment. Showing up disciplined, being there present right up until the end, and you make that final push. So here's the thing, my friends. How are you gonna be feeling on Christmas Day? Are you gonna be embracing and looking forward to 2015? Or are you gonna be thinking, man, I just cruised to the end of this year, and I had an okay year, and I'm not feeling really certain about the next year in real estate. Remember, stay focused, stay in action, and always stay in control.